there are three permissions that can be applied to folders for specific users. These are Read, Change, and Create. Let's look at an example. Let's say that we have created two user groups, Managers and Archive, on the Data Monitor server. Once these groups are created on the Data Monitor server, we can then apply permissions to these groups in the Web Center User Administration. We can now apply a permission to our new folders of Managers view and Plant Archives. For the managers, we would want to grant them full control for their Managers view folder, which might include pages that were designed to give them a snapshot view of the production process, including production counts. However, we would not want the users of the Archive group to have an access to this Managers view folder. When we look at the Plant Archives folder, we would want to grant a read-only permission to the users of Managers and full control to the Archive group. Next, we will show you a demonstration of setting permissions for the folders that we have created. This demonstration will follow the table that you see here. Click Next to continue. 